All right, we're back. We've got another street map to ride. So, let's get to it. All right. Hmm, straight away. I feel like I found some cool stuff to play around on. It's a bit like the Industrial Shadows map, which I posted not too long ago, maybe last week. It's kind of got a similar vibe, where it's like a bunch of stuff going on. Yeah, kind of... It's not awkwardly placed, but... Oh wow. Yeah, bunch of stuff going on all over the place, which looks kind of plain at first, but the more you see it, like especially that little thing, I love that. I don't really get many of those, and the fact that it works is cool as well. Yeah, figured I could nice pick on that thing. Uh, it's a map that has been out for a little while. I remember, I think I was going to make an edit on it, but for whatever reason, I didn't. But it's always kind of been on my mind as somewhere that I wanted to cover. Just need to pick a spot, I think. Okay. I remember this being a thing. This probably suits me, because it's like a bonk haven. Yup. Ooh. We get over. Oh, wow. I wasn't intending to doing that to do that back tire bump at the end, but it worked. I could play around on this forever, I think. I was just planning on trying to get over it, yeah. Double double bonk. works. Me being me, I could probably make a video just on this thing, honestly. Yeah, like, I could do all that stuff forever. <laughs> oh. I was asking a bit too much, I think. Uh, what could we do as a line? Quite temperamental, so yeah. That's my style. I think because I'm doing it all the time in these videos now, like I'm getting really good at them. Oops. I'm getting like consistent. Is it never? I don't know. It's just something I did for fun, but now doing it in these videos and people talking about me doing these in videos, I'm like bonk person. It's like a dubious name to have, probably, but you know. Can I tuck up? Oh, yeah. Sometimes I have this problem where the triggers don't work. Mm -mm. That's not the case. He is tucking up, okay. Yeah. Okay. Found this spot. So what can we do on this thing? Uh, Alright, so, found this thing as well, like straight away, which is always a good sign. You go from one spot to the next and it's immediately like, cool stuff, cool stuff, ideas. say that chicken666 who made this map Ooh, quick, get on uh, 
he made the Industrial Shadows map, which I did in a video. Did I already mention this? I can't remember. Yeah, he did a daytime version of that map. Oh, he's working on a daytime version of that map, which will be super useful for me because for whatever reason, my monitor is really bad at differentiating in like shades of black. Like, I don't know. It's just really bad at it for some reason. Cruising around at this point. Hey, we're coming up with something. What's this? This is the sign of a good map. Like, I'm literally freestyling and coming up with cool stuff. Uh, yeah, what was I saying? Um, Chicken666 was making a daytime version of that map, which will be super useful for me because for whatever reason, this monitor made it really dark. Even it is on the brightest settings and everything as well, so I don't really know what the problem is there. But yeah, I'm definitely going back to that map. This is that way he does the maps. I'm presuming it's he. Uh, I don't know, it's just really dense and like full of cool stuff everywhere. And it's all kind of unique as well, it's not just, I don't know, stairs, ledges. It's, well, that stuff is there, it's just done in a way that's kind of unique, which I appreciate. Because it's a chance for me to do something new, which I haven't done before. Okay, this is interesting as well. chance for a wall ride. It's something I'm down for. Spinning opposite, but yeah. I'm not sure when I'll be releasing this video, but um, MASH, the developer of this and EMX Streets, the eventual kind of end full game, released a video, not well, his last video presumably on uh, Instagram was like a 180 crank flip. And uh, yeah, it's looking really smooth. It's look In my eyes, I don't know what else needs to be done with that game. I guess obviously if he's releasing it as a full game, there's lots of, it's not just the physics. There's a lot of other aspects that need to be done, I guess, but it look, it's looked great for a long time. So I'm hoping there's like a test version that comes out or like a demo or just some way of playing around with the physics. Maybe we could give feedback on the physics. I presume he already has testers. Could we have a petition to like, let me be a tester for that game? I'll play the shit out of it. Obviously, it's a bit much to pre presume that I'm any better than a actual tester, but you know. Yeah, he loaded a video and it just looked really good. If you haven't been watching um, that Instagram account, you're in for a treat because you'll have a bunch of videos of streets to binge. They're all very short. He also had like a, what are they called? Motor, not a motorbike, you know, the motocross type bike that's also in the game somehow. I guess he did it for fun, but it actually looks like physics wise it works and everything. So if he has a bunch of other stuff like that in there, that would be super interesting. It may also mean that people can mod in stuff like that as well in the future. Obviously, people have already done mountain bikes and stuff for this game. It's not something I've actually tried, but... Oops. Right, I'm rambling. I'm rambling, but I'm actually like... Just constantly going around finding stuff to do, which is pretty rare. Again, okay. sign... Did I? Get up. Ok. 
Okay, we need to find something else to session. Just so I'm not rambling the whole time. I think we're going to come back to this because looking at it from this direction, this is also pretty interesting. We need to bonk that, I think. Nope, not good enough. I get a bunch of people asking how to mod the game to uh, what, what is it? 1.9.9. .9. Go to the Volution Discord. That will give you all the help you need. Me, honestly, like the way it works now, I don't really understand it either. I've got to follow the guide that they have there. There's a bunch of tutorials and stuff on YouTube, but I think a lot of that's out of date. You want to go to the Volution Discord, and there's like a text document with like the latest method of playing the game. That would be your best reference, I think. And anybody there can help you out with a lot of problems as well. Just be nice, because they'll probably yell at you. Because obviously a lot of people go in there asking questions without actually checking the guides. Which, when you're a mod, is obviously going to weigh you out, I think. Instead of stressing too much about doing particular tricks, I think I'm just going to enjoy this map for what it is. Because it's rare. Sometimes it feels like I've got to really search for a spot. This won't work with magnets, but if you get it just right, you should be able to double peg it. I said I was going to cruise around, and I immediately find something. If you're at a more diagonal angle, it will. He's trying to home on to something, just I don't know what. Yeah. Hmm. The other way is just to lock out and get it perfectly on top. Which... I've tried to do that sort of thing before. It takes a long time. You will get it. No. Mm -hmm. That mysterious front wheel glide that happens sometimes. That was sort of it. It's manual around this, but actually in this version of the game, when you manual and turn, you keep going faster. You wouldn't be able to do it, I don't think. Those manual would be better, but it may be too steep. Being too gentle because I don't want a G turn. Hey, kind of worked. I forgot my wobbles there. That's one thing. Doing videos and tricks. Don't just hold down the stick like this, especially not at the highest, like the furthest back. You should be able to see the pad on the screen. If you're just holding it down the full way, Kind of like an awkward angle. You kind of want it half down. You just kind of want to like feather it, make it look like an actual manual's happening and he's balancing. Otherwise, it looks pretty stiff. Same with uh, nose manuals as well. It seems really awkward at first, but you do get used to it. Sometimes I think I should just do like an ASM, what is it? I don't know, I never watch those videos. Those things sort of like creep me out a bit. Just doing tricks. Put on like a radio voice or something. Just constantly flowing around a map. Again, me being me, I'm ignoring all this park stuff. We'll show it anyway. Actually, no, we won't because we're miles away. I'll just show it to you. This is the manual glitch, which gives you a ridiculous amount of speed, which is good for getting gaps. Obviously, that didn't work that time, but if you have a gap that doesn't work, 
and you're on 1.1. One point one, wait, wait 1.9.9. 1 .9. You can use that. They got rid of the glitch on 2.0, I think. Showing the ramps. Ooh, what is that? Is that a curved? Ooh. Ooh. First thing in my head was I want to kind of curved wall ride that to something on here to the rail, but I get the feeling it's not big enough for that. Yeah. Maybe able to get onto the ledge. This video is a lot of that trick, I think. Ooh. Going backwards, going forwards. Trails. Okay, that's another sign for me to like try something on it because rail rides don't work if there's a kink, it boots you off them, or it can. So they can be pretty interesting sometimes. Yeah. As soon as an angle happens, you may go off from a straight line. So that first time was lucky, maybe? Maybe not. I'm gonna end this video, I'm just having fun, like screwing around. Ah, oh. yes, I think that may be a bit hard to clear every time. Hmm, let's go at a diagonal, may give you a bigger. Rely on that wall, maybe to get something off it. We'll get it. At some point, don't know when. Mm. Harder than I thought. getting in the way. There we go. Kind of happy with it, just as is, to be honest. Also, yeah, I haven't been doing any other tricks. I'll just do my usual nonsense. Just wondering if I could get a turn down off it, but... see a super skinny ledge. A manual won't work because it'll speed up too much. Oh shit, I changed colour on my back. Didn't even know you could do that at this point. Trees. Ok, 
Okay then, don't knock on. Little on the floor. Ah, I was going to try and back tie that bit. Hmm? Unintentional bonk. As you can see, you get loads of speed. This should be alright. Nope. I don't know what that, how that's caused. And as soon as you clip like a side or anything, you're done. You get a weird glitch. Happening. Okay, go. It would have been cool if it worked, but now I'm trapped. <laughs> God. Well, we got out of it. Yeah, I could play on this map forever. This is cool. It's always the simple stuff as well. Simple but complex, does that make sense? It doesn't have to be like a super elaborate setup of ramp. Just has to be a bunch of shapes in an interesting way. Laid out in an interesting way, I mean. Okay, I'm gonna do one more thing. I don't know how it's gonna work, and if it doesn't work, we'll figure out something else. I want to go from the bank to the wall behind it. I'm not sure if it's going to work. See the part that's lit up in the background? I kind of want to see... Yeah, that'll work. easier to get a 180. They tend to work better. I'm not really sure why that is. Oh, it feels like there's more leeway. Yeah. Okay. What else could we do on this thing? Actually. I, was, I said that was going to be the end, didn't I? I lied. Well, this could be the last area. We get this. I'll call it a day, I think. Yeah. Alright. I say that. We need our traditional last run until we bail thing. So, we'll do that. I'm not talking whatsoever. Shit. We can do better than that. I have one more go. Sorry. Oh, this is a tricky spot as well. You know, casual. We 
do on that? We can. Oh. One more. It's to the point where I want to keep going and probably the viewers want me to stop. Consider this like bonus time. You don't have to hang around for this part. I'm just trying to like entertain myself. Okay. Do this bit right. There we go. Going down the curve bit at the end. Ah. Oh well. Yes. This is. Hang on, I've forgotten the name. Small Town, I think? But it'll be in the description. And it's by Chicken666. Same as the industrial something map, which I've also forgot the name of through the process of filming this video. I apologize. Yeah, it'll all be down there. It's a really cool map. Super tech. Loads of stuff everywhere. It's also got a park as well, which obviously I didn't show that much, but if that's your thing, there's also that aspect as well. And yeah. Good stuff. Thank you as always for watching. Plenty more to come. There's a ton of maps I've still got to do. I listed it all out and there's loads. I've been going for ages and that's without even thinking of any new maps that come out, so no end to that. I also want to kind of get back into Skater XL and Session and other stuff a bit more as well. It's kind of just been this game only recently, which is nice when I'm in the mood for it, but nice to do other stuff as well. Maybe play some more Noiter as well. And yeah, that's about it. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.